So in this video, we are going to understand how do you target people on Facebook ads? How do you use the detailed targeting option available on Facebook ads, which I've seen most of the people, most of the people who are starting out on Facebook ads do not use this option. And what happened because of that is they end up targeting everyone with a limited budget and they do not get the results. This is one of the very common mistakes I've seen people making. So by the end of this video, you will understand the detailed targeting option on Facebook ads. And I'm sure you're going to improve your Facebook ads ROI as well. So let's jump directly onto the screen. If you see, I'm already on my campaign setup. So I've created a campaign and I'm on my ad set level in the audience section. This is where we target. So if you uh, under location, if you come down, you will see this option called detailed targeting. Now, if you see, if I don't target anyone, my potential audience size in India is 408 million people. That's like very broad. So I don't want to do that. I want to narrow down my audience to a specific level where the people are interested in my product, whatever the product I'm trying to sell. So if you see under detailed targeting, you will see this search bar and you will see this option called browse. In the browse, you have three types of audiences based on demographic, based on interest and based on behavior. You can go ahead and explore all of these options, you know, based upon uh, if they are related to your product. If you want to do, uh, target all of these, uh, you know, interest or behaviors or demographic. But for this video, I will take an example. Uh, let's take an example of MBA degree or MBA course. Uh, let's say I'm trying to sell it for a university and I want to target all the people who are interested in MBA. So for that, let's say I will just directly go here and search for MBA. Okay. So here it gives me an option MBA and I'll target that MBA as an interest. And once I target MBA as an interest, I can click on then suggestions and it'll give me related suggestion to the product. So again, master's degree, post-graduation degree, sorry, post-graduation degree, higher education, and then university, higher education. I see two of them, university, higher education. Yeah, and then um bachelor's degree no people are not interested in bachelors for this one it is masters business school yeah maybe business school and yeah so i think these are enough if you see you know uh, our total potential size has now come down to 204 million people and after this you know this is this is how i have targeted all the people who are interested in mba Okay, now there is an option called narrow audience. Narrow means by using this option, you can target people who have two separate interests. And you know, that will be a commonality between all these people. So for example, if I click on narrow audience, and in this, I will target all the people who already have a bachelor's degree. Okay, because obviously to do an MBA, you need a bachelor's, right? So I'll click on browse. I'll go to demographic this time. I'll go to education, education level. And I will choose out of these people who have already done the graduation. So at high school or maybe at university or no, not, or maybe university. I think we can pick that doctorate, no foundation degree. I think that can be picked, but not here high school liver uh, master's degree uh, professional degree some high school some university maybe we can pick that and we can also pick uh, you know university graduate so i'll pick that as well and uh, this is how i have targeted all the people who already have a bachelor's if you see so there are about 48 million people uh, uh, who are who has bachelor's and who are interested in masters or mba Okay, so that's what I've done. You can also exclude people. So this is you, you're saying I'm bucketing these things. So this is one bucket, this is another bucket. And this what this is doing is it is narrowing down my entire audience to some specific pool of people who are highly interested in the product which I'm trying to sell. Okay, then also there's an option called exclude. You need to do exclusion in this case. 
and what will be exclusion people who already have a master's degree obviously you know they don't want to do uh, masters again there are exception people do double masters also but you know this is not a general case so i will again click on browse go to demographic this time education education level and i will actually you know ta exclude people so at university post graduate exclude them and then doc doctorate foundation high school masters degree we have a masters degree as well a uh, professional degree not this one some university uh, i think post graduate yes so this one also we can exclude so if you see here what's happening i've excluded people who already have uh, a masters okay we don't want to target all the people who already have a masters so that's third bucket i've created so if you can see there are about 48 million to 57 million people in india uh, who are interested in masters doing masters degree who have done bachelor's degree already and who have not yet done the masters degree so this is how we precisely target audience then obviously it also will be you can restrict the age you know obviously people uh, between the age of 20 to you know let's say we can take 35 maybe that will be our audience so that comes down to 36 million people but today we are just talking about the detailed targeting options and this is how we actually target people on facebook ads with different interest don't be i see people making this mistake that one thing they don't even target anyone and they end up reaching out to everyone mostly that's a mistake you don't want to do that with the limited budget second thing they do is they target but they just create one bucket and uh, you know uh, put all of those things into one bucket and never use these options like narrow down and all of the, those things but now this is something which can be debatable in 2023 because facebook works better if you don't restrict it if you keep it open okay so earlier you know these were the things we used to use they work right now also but facebook works even better if you allow it Uh, you know if you don't restrict it uh, to by adding bunch of different interest targeting in your campaigns but these are very important if you have very limited budgets uh, and uh, with the limited budgets we want to just reach out to very specific audiences who are highly interested in our product if you have any questions just drop them in the comment section below and you can also check out the entire facebook ads playlist i've linked them in the description below and check out this particular video on facebook ads i'm sure you're going to love this one as well and i will meet you in the next video very soon thank you